Assalamu alaikum. Today we are going to see some MCQs related immunity and its types. Question number one. Which of the following systems protect our body against disease causing microbes? Options are immune system, digestive system, excretory system and respiratory system. Right answer is immune system. Immune system protects our body against disease causing microbes. Question number two. Which of the following immunity is present from our birth? Options are innate immunity, active immunity, passive immunity, acquired immunity. Right answer is innate immunity. This is present in our body from birth. Question number three. Neutrophils, basophils, lymphocytes, eosinophils, and monocytes are examples of Options are physical barrier, cellular barrier, cytokine barrier, physiological barrier. Right answer is cellular barriers. All these are cellular barriers. Question number four. B cells and T cells are type of cells involved in. Options are innate immunity, active immunity, passive immunity and acquired immunity. Right answer is delta, acquired immunity. B cells and T cells are types of acquired immunity. Question number 5. The common disorders caused by poor immune system include Options are epidemic diseases, deficiency diseases, autoimmune diseases and none of these. Right answer is alpha epidemic diseases. Common disorders caused by poor immune system are epidemic diseases. Question number 6. Which of the following cells is involved in cell mediated immunity? Options are T cells, B cells, mast cells, and both T and B cells. Right answer is alpha T cells. T cells are involved in cell mediated immunity. Question number seven Which of the following cells are involved in humoral immunity? Options are T cells, B cells, mast cells, both P and T cells. In previous questions, we have seen that T cells are involved in cell mediated immunity. So, right option is beta B cells. B cells are involved in humoral immunity. Question number 8 Which of the following immunity is obtained during lifetime? Options are innate immunity, active immunity, passive immunity, both P and C. Both active and passive immunity. Right option is delta, both P and C. Innate immunity is present in our body from birth and active and passive immunity is obtained during lifetime. So right option is delta. Question number 9. Skin, body hair, cilia, eyelashes, the respiratory tract and gastrointestinal tract are examples of. Options are physical barriers, cellular barrier, cytokine barrier, physiological barriers. So these barriers are examples of physical barriers. Right option is alpha physical barriers. Question number 10. Which of the following immunity is called first line of defense? Options are innate immunity, active immunity, passive immunity, acquired immunity. Right option is alpha innate immunity. Innate immunity is called first line of defense and innate immunity is present in our body before birth. Question number 11. How many lines of defense are present in our body? Options are 1, 2, 3 and 4. Right option is Charlie, 3. There are 3 lines of defense present in our body and these are First line is physical and physiological barrier. Second line of defense is cellular and cytokine barrier. And third line of defense is humoral and cell mediated immunity. Question number 12. Which type of immunity provides long-lasting protection against pathogens? Options are innate immunity, active immunity, passive immunity, adaptive immunity. Right answer is beta, active immunity. Active immunity provides long-lasting protection against pathogens. Question number 13. Vaccination primarily triggers which type of immunity? Options are passive 
innate active or adaptive immunity right answer is chartley active immunity question number 14 which cells are considered the first responders of the immune system and play a key role in inflammation options are t cells b cells macrophages natural killer cells right answer is chartley macrophages macrophages are first responders of immune system and play key role in inflammation question number 15 which of the following is a function of t cells options are producing antibodies engulfing pathogens directly killing infected cells and producing histamine right answer is chartley directly killing infected cells is the function of t cells Question number 16 which class of antibodies is the most abundant in the blood stream right option is chartley question number 17 which type of immune response is responsible for allergic reactions options are type 1 hypersensitivity type 2 hypersensitivity type 3 hypersensitivity or type 4 hypersensitivity right option is alpha type 1 hypersensitivity Type one hypersensitivity is responsible for allergic reactions. Question number eighteen: What is the role of dendritic cells in the immune system? Options are producing antibodies, engulfing pathogens, presenting antigens to T cells, or killing infected cells. Right answer is Chartley. Presenting antigens to T cells is the role of dendritic cells in the immune system. Question number nineteen: What is the primary function of thymus gland in the immune system? Options are production of antibodies, maturation of T cells, filtration of lymph, and production of cytokines. Right answer is beta. Maturation of T cells is the primary function of thymus gland in the immune system. Question number twenty. Which immunoglobin is involved in the defense against parasites and allergic responses? Right answer is Charlie. Thank you so much for watching. Allah Hafiz.